Today we're going to recreate Rachel Brosnahan's look. Um, it consisted of a red and vanilla colored eye and the rest of the face was kept really bare and fresh. I like to start with a really even base color when I'm doing a really elaborate eye just so it takes any of the natural tones. This is also going to help hold the makeup, especially because it's a really bold, bright color. So I'm going to use a little bit of this red metallic cream shadow to start. I started by applying the shadow from the outer corner of the eye towards the inside. So you're going to get the darkest, deepest shade of red towards the outer corner and then it's going to fade as it gets into the center of the lid. I like to use something lighter. Put a little bit of this sort of shimmery vanilla on the inner corner. I'm just going to put a little bit of translucent powder above the cream so the powder has something to blend into. And for longevity and extra brightness, <laughs> I went over the red with almost the exact same color but in a powder formula. You can see how it just gives it more dimension and like intensity right away. Just to add a tiny bit more depth after I've done the red, I like to create a little bit of a frame with a taupey brown shade. And I just, look up for me, gave like just a teeny hint of red right on the outer corner. Then I like to go back in with the first brush that I used with the eyeshadow base on it. And I can just kind of smooth all the colors and blend them together. Um, right where I put that little hint of sort of that vanilla kind of sparkle, I just added a teeny bit of powder on top. Again, just to intensify it just slightly and go in with a nice volumizing mascara. You wanna just wiggle the brush from the lash line outwards. I wanted to use a color that mimicked Rachel's lips today for the shoot, but had a little bit of vibrancy to fill them in and complement the eye. So I went with this sort of tinted lip conditioner. So this is our look today, and um, I hope I gave you some helpful tips to recreate Rachel Brosnahan's look.